Hey, welcome to Electron Online, and here's our first example of how to use Lahapato's rule to solve this right here. Let's try it without using Lahapato's rule. If we let x equal 1, this now becomes the natural log of 1 divided by 1 minus 1. The natural log of 1 is 0, and 1 minus 1 is 0, and so this is undetermined or undefined, 0 divided by 0. So according to Lahapato's rule, we should be able to take the derivative of both the numerator and the denominator, and then take the limit as x approaches 1. Let's see what happens. So we're going to say this is equal to the limit as x approaches 1 of the derivative of the numerator, which is equal to 1 over x, divided by the derivative of the denominator, which is 1. So 1 divided by x divided by 1, uh, well, that would be equal to 1 over x. Oop, I forgot my limit sign. I can't do that. So it's equal to the limit as x approaches 1 of 1 divided by x. Now I can go ahead and plug 1 in for x. So this is equal to 1 over 1, which is 1, and that is the answer. So initially, when you allow x to go to 1 of this problem, you don't get the right answer. You get an undetermined answer. But if you take the derivative of the numerator, the derivative of the natural log of x is 1 over x, the derivative of the denominator is 1, that becomes the limit as x goes to 1 of 1 over x, which is simply equal to 1. And so it's pretty easy. Pretty straightforward. That's how we do that.